Hi everybody, today we are going to do a three month forecast. So we are going to pull one card for the start of October, the start of November, and the start of December. And we are going to pull further tarot in, but let's just start with um, one card for each month and then we will get further into each one with um, some deeper tarot. So let's pull a card to start. We'll go with October. So let's pull one card for October. Oh my goodness, we have the sun, the success, whatever you've been working towards. It's like you finally are getting it. Um, it's finally coming in for you. You are finally receiving what you've been asking for, what you've been working for. It's like you're feeling blessed. You feel like um, you have everything that you've been asking for and more. Sorry if you can hear my puppy out there. He wants to come in. Um, but it's like everything that you have been asking for is here. It's coming to you. Um, it's everything and more. It's so successful. It's so much happiness around you. So let's pull a card for November. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. So we have awakening. So you are coming into whatever it is. Um, so this success, you could be um, taking it further. You are trying to go further. You're really coming into the realization of like everything that you need to do. Um, something could be eye opening. You're finally feeling like you have this like new beginning. Um, <coughs> sorry. I feel like there's this like new beginning coming in and it's like you have this like whole new learning process to do and you have no idea about it until the success comes to you and then here you are you have this new learning you are taking a second to be so grateful for everything around and trying to expand learn more have this like new beginning for yourself yeah here you are um while i'm saying that this card popped out you are really going to just be like taking a look around and being so grateful um like taking a pause in the moment and being like wow i i am so happy like i knew this was going to happen for me and i'm so grateful and you're going to want to like expand this so let's pull one card um for how our december is going to go whatever by the end of the year you have everything that you have asked for and more. Um, by December, it is all coming in for you. You are feeling successful. You are feeling happy. You are feeling cheerful. You feel like um, everything, if this is a paycheck um, with this coming out, I just feel like uh, with the him like holding the um, envelope right here, I just feel like it is just like a success. Like there is something coming in it. This is like a, maybe like a paycheck, an unexpected paycheck, like at the end of the year in December, maybe you get like a Christmas bonus that kind of puts you a little bit of a head more than you had thought or um, something like that. But it is so um, pretty. December looks like you're just fin finishing out the year so strong and happy and like thankful, successful. Um, you are grateful for everything that you have. Let's pull um, three cards of this tarot. Oh, okay. So we have this. Okay. So we have the chariot falling out. By the end of the year, you have this victory. This victory is coming in for you. Um, you are going to feel successful. You are going to feel, and you know what's so crazy? The seven standing out, seven, 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 the lucky numbers. So if you are feeling lucky, if you are feeling intuitive about something, if you just know something in your soul is going to happen, believe that and go on that feeling and do not let anything change because we really manifest, um, we manifest everything. And if you are believing that like this is going to change, you're going to, if you're believing like you're going to have this job, you're going to have this love, you're going to have this house, you're going to have this success by the end of the year, it's going to come in for you. Yeah, here you are. You're being in, you're in charge of your beginning. Um, this just flew out too. You're in charge of this beginning. You don't have to worry about um, anything going wrong. As long as you keep your mind right, you keep your karma good, you keep your slate clean, um, and you continue to keep that like energy flowing and pure, I, it's going to come in and it's going to come in strong. So let's pull three more um, cards for October. We're going to pull three tarot cards for October. Okay, so it looks like October, you are going through this like financial 
um, like area. And that's what I said by December, I see like a paycheck. I see like maybe in October, it's kind of like you might have a little bit of a hard time. Um, it's still not going as easy as you had thought it was. Yeah, like you have a little bit of a fear, a little bit of an anxiety of um, what's going to happen. Um, I feel like financially specifically is what your um, insecurity is, but it looks like you are going to have by the end of October, it's like here it is for you. You start off, um, and it's like it's kind of hard at the beginning of October. You're kind of like, damn, like um, this, that, or the other. You're like, dang, like I wish this could, ha I wish this could change, or like, uh, you know, just like things like that. And then here you are, like worried about it. You're like, am I gonna have enough money? Am I gonna um, be able to make ends meet? Am I like, here's this stress for you, right? But here you are, things are working out, things are coming um, in and things are going to get fixed for you. So you really um, need to trust that. Remember when you are feeling stressed out, when you are feeling like stuff's like not going to work out, keep in that positive mindset. It's like I, you feel it in your soul. You know, it's something that belongs to you. Um, if you have this like intuitive, like, you know, I'm going to do this, I'm going to get this, this is going to happen to me. Whatever it is for you, October seems like it, whatever this is, this could be financially, this could be love life, this could be whatever this goal is, because this is very general. There is a goal that you are trying to get to at the beginning of October, and it's like it puts you a lot of like anxiety, you have a lot of self-doubt, you have a lot of fear towards whatever it is. And it's like by the end of October, here it is, here it is being handed to you. Here you are, the work being paid off. Things are finally coming in. It's like by the end of October, you finally have it. So let's pull um, a card for the beginning, middle and end of November. So we're gonna pull three cards for the beginning, middle and end of our November. Yes, here you are. November, it's like you are learning how to make these changes. You are learning how to fix this situation. Yeah, this stress, this fear, this anxiety, it's leaving. We are learning how to get out of here. You are no longer going to be um, in this energy anymore. Yeah, here you are. You're no longer going to be in this energy anymore. You're ready to get out of this energy. You, um, It's like successful. By the end of November, it's like, you finally have whatever it is that you've been asking for. Oh, this card just fell out. So let's see what this says. So I feel like you holding on to anything. Um, let's say that you are thinking, uh, like, how am I going to make it? How am I going to do this? How How is this going to work out? It's like, it's going to work out. And you need to, like, let go of that. You holding on to it is, like, just causing you that anxiety and fear. It's causing that blockage. So let's pull um two more clarifiers for november let's just get how is the end of november going to work out for all of us how is the end of november going to look okay so we have these three cards so we are letting go we are letting go of this energy right here, um, feeling trapped, feeling um, stuck, feeling like there's nothing that we can do to get out of there. We're putting an end to that. It's stopping. We're done with this energy. Here we are in a, in a successful state. We are, um, it's it's going, it's flowing. Here we are. Everything is working out just the way that it needs to, just the way that it should. Let's pull um, three more. Let's go into December and let's see how our December is going to go. Let's pull three cards for our December outcome. How is December going to end for all of us? We're going to pull one for the beginning, one for the middle, and one for the end. Look at that. You are feeling so happy, so blessed. So here you are feeling happy, feeling blessed, feeling like you are so grateful in this love. Yes, you are happy um, with your hard work, your dedication, you're choosing to stick with it. Um, you are just feeling like you have everything um, that you have been asking for and more. Yes, I feel like you had this patience, you had this hard work, and it's like it paid off and you are so grateful um, that it paid off. And at the end of December, I feel like there's like an extra bit of money coming um, for you. It was like, maybe you didn't expect it. Like it was kind of un unexpected or like maybe money was supposed to come and it comes like late in December, but like there's like something unexpected coming in in December and it's something that you've been asking for and it like just kind of helps shows up and it makes you feel so blessed and um, 
like it finally, like finally you feel like spirits listening. And I feel like, um, terrible to say that because, but I feel like maybe you, uh, you, it's just like, you don't think that spirit always like has your back. You're like, come on spirit. Like, why would this happen to me? We have the Empress right here. And I just wanted to pull a clarifier for December in December. You are feeling so, so amazing. You are feeling so good about yourself, financially, mentally, physically, emotionally, in your career, in your home, whatever it is for you. This is like, you're finally feeling good. You're finally feeling like you have everything that you have been asking for. All right. So what I want to do is I want to pull a theme card for each month and we're going to see um, what we could really focus on <clears throat> in that month. So we're going to pull one card for October, one card for November, and one card for December. Oh, okay. So we had three cards just fall out. Okay. So right here we have flow. In November, go with the flow. If you are feeling um, any type of way, if you are feeling uh, like caught up in a challenge, if you are feeling like a situation isn't working out in November go, or October, go with the flow. I feel like um, October might be a little bit challenging for you, but we kind of seen that in the cards. It's like uh, there's a situation and it's kind of bothering you. There's a situation that's kind of challenging for you, but here you are. You're going to go with the flow. You're going to let go of it because here's the thing worrying and stressing about that is going to do nothing for you right so what it, you need to do is just let it go and put it out to the universe to fix it and i promise you changes will come in here we are in november transformation we've seen that in the cards right so we are finally transforming um in november we're finally like figuring it out we're finally um, turning into this beautiful being, whether this be financially, home, mentally, physically, all around, like you are transforming and feeling so much better. Whatever you have been asking for, whatever you have wanted, um, it's like it's finally just happening. November is your month. Like October, it's like you're learning. By the end of October, you're finally getting whatever it is you're asking for. But November, here it is. You will finally learn and you're continuing to learn. You're like ready to change into this beautiful being that you were supposed to be this whole time. And here you are. We have courage and boldness. You have this. You're strong. You you know everything that you've been wanting, everything that you want to do, everything that you want to be. Here you are. You have it. And you don't need to worry about any of that anymore. So let's pull one card um, for each month, um, an oracle, just to get one last message from Spirit, just to see one last thing that Spirit has to say um, for October, one for November, and then one for December. So we're just going to pull three oracles. So we're going to start with October. So wisely. And I love that it comes out with October because we have the flow, we have the struggle. So it says, whatever you send out to others will be returned to you. So I love that. The law of the universe, if you send out anger, it will be given to you more and you will have more reasons to be angry. If you send out generosity and love, those are what you will receive with abundance. So here you are in October. Like I said, it, October might start off a little hard, but you're finally going to get whatever it is that you've been asking for. Whatever you um, want, it's going to come in. It's like coming in at the end of October and you need to really go with the flow. Remember to not be negative. Remember to really trust yourself. Um, in October, it's going to be hard. It's going to be a struggle, but it's like by the end of October, whatever you have been praying for, whatever your dreams are, um, it's like they're finally coming in in November. So let's pull one card for November. What's one Oracle card for our November? Perfection. I love this. Each day, devote a little time to daydreaming about the perfect health. Keep your thoughts focused, constructive, and enjoyable. Trust that whatever you are dreaming will soon manifest into your life. And I love that because here we are in November, things are changing. And here we are in October, we're trying to change our mindset. We're trying to go with the flow and we're going to keep our mindset there in November. Even if things are going wrong, we're going to keep our mindset there. We're going to continue to go with the flow. We're going to find the perfection. Um, we're going to find the happiness. We're going to enjoy every little thing that we possibly can um, because that's exactly what you're supposed to do. Everything is changing for you in November. And it's like you have this perfection. You have this enjoyability about everything again. So let's pull one card for December. 
deserve yes you deserve everything um it is that you have been asking for and more and i'm sorry if you can hear my dog it's like every time i stop talking he stops whining and then when i start talking he starts whining so i think he just has some input um your emotions act like a magnet to your situations they mirror the emotions if you want to improve your relationships behave the other behave ways that you want other way um, others to behave towards you so you deserve everything coming to you in um, in December. Everything that you have wanted it is coming to you. You're getting everything. And remember, manifesting is a real thing. So continue to put out that good energy. Continue to put out that love. And I promise it will be returned to you times 10, times 100. Like you're manifesting and your mind is so strong. So keep in that positive mindset and know that these next three months are going to be amazing and keep strong in October because I promise you by November, you will be so happy that you did. You are changing. You are into this new beautiful being. And then by November or by December, it's like, here it is. You finally have everything that um, you've been asking for. It's like being handed to you. So I hope everybody enjoyed their message.